Hi Libra, welcome to your almost daily love reading. This is Chelsea and I appreciate your love and support for subscribing to my channel. At the end of your reading, I'll pull up more cards for some love and money advice. And Libra, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. Alright Libra, we're going to find out how does a person currently feel about you. Spirit and angels, please show me how does Libra's person currently feel about them. Okay, Libra. So they miss you. Six of Cups is right here. They think about you a lot. I feel they always reminisce about the good times that both of you have shared with each other. We've got the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. They feel that you no longer um, is wanting to invest, like you've already pulled away from them. Okay, got the Magician here. They may be trying to manifest you back into their life, okay? Um, with the Magician and the Emperor, perhaps figuring something out. I do sense a lot of regrets. Nine of Swords is here, Sleepless Nights, Anxiety. I feel like they finally see the truth, okay? I feel like it has something to do with a choice, because Two of Swords could indicate a choice. Or that they feel like you've already made a choice okay with the three of pentacles here in reverse that you do not want to reconcile with them and with the three of cups in reverse as well mm. they're not happy they're not celebrating anything at all they definitely are sulking nine of swords here we've got an another nine of pentacles in reverse they are dependent on you in some way shape or form we've also got the ace of pentacles here they want a new beginning with you However, the stars in reverse, so they feel that maybe you find it really hard to forgive them because three swords is right here. Maybe they could have broken your heart. For some of you, this could have been a love triangle situation. Page of Cups, they're sorry that they hurt you. They're really, really sorry that they hurt you and they really wanted this new beginning with you, but they feel like maybe it's a little bit too late that maybe you won't want to reconcile with them you're not going to give them a time of the day of a day okay so the emperor here at libra it does look like they want to step up their game okay they finally are serious i feel like it's funny they've grown from a page to an emperor i feel like they have grown overnight because of this experience with you like it really hit them hard um if this hasn't happened yet could be a prediction all right a sub Ace of Swords, similar first. Page of Wands, similar first. I feel like both of you may not be communicating right now. Maybe one person wants to communicate, but the other person is sort of not paying attention or not not allowing this person to reach out for some of you, okay? Because Two of Swords could indicate sometimes block communication for some of you. Um, but they feel like you possibly have seen things very clearly and you finally know what you want, which is to walk away from them. The chariot right here. This could also mean that they want to walk towards you. They want to move towards you, towards reconciliation here. They can't start over. I feel like um, maybe they could have tried. Maybe they could have tried dating other people. I feel like um, I'll connect with other people, but none of them compares to you they can't start over with anybody i feel like they only want you okay page of ones in reverse could also indicate somebody who is immature i feel like they were they could have been very immature in the way they were thinking the way they were operating but because of this ex experience again with you i feel like they've grown more mature okay they actually, the emperor, or maybe sometimes the emperor could also mean that you've made a decision. They feel like you made a decision and that perhaps the ball is in your court, okay? Yeah, they don't want this to be over because death is in reverse. Uh, Libra, I just saw 444 in my, on my stopwatch. So if you guys would like to check your angel number 444, you can Google it. And death is another so they don't want this to be over definitely wanting to reconcile they want to fix things mm. queen of cups in reverse yeah 
if there's a third party, somehow I feel like um, they could could have lost the third party as well, or letting go of the third party. Nine of Cups is here. I feel like they are very apologetic over what happened here between the two of you. It does look like they do love you and they want to take action towards you, okay? They've been missing you a lot, that's for sure. Hmm. Maybe let's get you some advice, love advice for Libra, two of cups, show me more. So you got the three of swords in reverse, and you've got this three of swords in the upright position early on. Spirit says time to heal, okay? Um, there's, it's like the magician is in reverse, so whatever you whatever this person i feel like their true colors have been revealed already you already know who this person is how this person is so spirit says you know don't overthink don't overanalyze because you know it is what it is and ace of swords in reverse and the ten of pentacles is also in reverse you've got two aces in reverse so spirit is saying that perhaps your person could still be lying may not be telling you the truth and Ten of Pentacles is in reverse, so something about no stability, and it's not clear yet, to be honest, Libra, right now, what's going to happen between you and your person, but I do sense that the advice is to not to overthink and start thinking about walking away, because the King of, uh, sorry, the Nine of Pentacles is right here. I feel like, Libra, there is somebody out there for you, somebody completely honest, okay, um, stable, hardworking, that could be actually your soulmate. And this new person, uh, this past person, they may not be able to give you that, you know, stability or loyalty or even money, okay? Libra, but you don't have to listen to my advice. It's completely up to you right now. The current energy is what is showing right now. Who, who knows? Things may change. All right. Libra, let's get you some money advice. Money advice for Libra. Cut this card again. Mm, yep, there's a new opportunity for you guys, Libra, actually. When it comes to money, not of swords, you could be stressing out a lot in regards of your money situation or your career. So, uh, death card indicates, you know, an ending to an era. I feel like um, an era of perhaps, you know, something of uh, uh, the type of work you've been doing for a long time. Perhaps it's time to let it go and actually choose something that you truly, truly love to do. It looks like it will be a better opportunity for you to grow. Let's look at the King of Pentacles. There's another opportunity out there for you. Spirit says you're not actually looking hard enough. If you look hard enough, but look into your heart. Okay, what you truly would love to do, something that is very sustainable and at the same time will help you make some money or if not a lot. King of Pentacles, it looks like it's going to start really small, but it can, it has a chance. I mean, it has an opportunity for it to grow really, really, really huge, okay? All right, Libra, this is your reading. I hope you liked it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Currently, I am accepting personal reading requests. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me. If nothing else, hope to see you tomorrow as I've been posting new videos almost every single day lately. Take care, Libra. Bye.